when I was growing up, my grandmother always told me, get your own and keep your own. And when she told me this, I was really, really young. So the thing about my grandma, he called her my mom. But the thing about my, my mom is she would tell us stuff way ahead of our time. Like she would drop knowledge and gems on us that we didn't even know was gems when she was telling us. Like, what is an eight-year-old supposed to know about this? What's a 12-year-old supposed to know about what you're saying? But she would tell us these things. I believe it's so that we could have that knowledge with us when the time came and we found ourselves in that situation. That's what I think she told us that for. And I think she told us that too, based off of her own personal experiences that she had in her life. She wanted to share that with us to make sure that we got our own and kept our own. I know she told me that. I don't know who else she told that to, but she definitely told that to me. And that was something that stuck with me for a long, long time. So me going out in the world, growing up into a young adult, my dating options, looking at the dating scene and me knowing in the back of my mind, like, okay, well, I got to get my own and keep my own. So that means for me, okay, I got to find a man who's willing to support that. Somebody who's going to support my individuality and be in support of what it is that I'm doing with my talents and my education and my knowledge and my skills and my experiences. And after uh, over 20, 20 years, 25 years plus dating, I have yet to come across a man who was in support of me having my own, getting my own, going out into the world, you know, exploring new opportunities and, and setting new goals and plans and executing them. I haven't found a man like that. I've ran into some men who pretended to be that way, but once the truth come out, they fold. That wasn't really who they were. They were just pretending. So to see women too, seeing more women come out nowadays about how a man is not a plan. That goes right in the line of what my grandmom has always been telling me for as long as I can remember. Get your own and keep your own. I mean, don't depend on no man. That's what that sounded like to me. Even though she had two husbands, you know, she still was like, you know, I got to get my own. I got to keep my own. I got to stay educated. got to have a job. So me having to go out into the world and date, it's just really not something that I felt like I needed. So I don't put a lot of time and a lot of energy, a lot of effort behind me trying to use a man as a plan. You know, how much money does he have? Is he broke or not? No, I'm looking for peace and support and love and kindness and humanity. So the things that I was looking at, you know, a young woman in my 20s out here in the world dating, the things I was looking for, it's not the things that your typical 20 something year old is looking for when she's out there dating. So that created an extra bit of difficulty for me. Yeah, and, and don't get me wrong, y'all, because I, I partied in my 20s. I did. I partied real bad. But uh, the, the goals were still the same. It doesn't matter how much I went out and I like to dance. I wasn't much of a drinker. I didn't drink. I even had my first drink until I was like 26 years old. I was 26 years old and I had a Mike's Hard Lemonade. My thing was I would go out and I would dance. I would like to dance, 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 and dance, honey. Like, you couldn't tell me nothing. So even if I did bump into a guy, you know, oh, I'm out and about, I'm not going home with you. You know, there was rules, there was some standards. But I'm still looking for certain things. Like, I just never was a hookup chick. I was never, like, into none of the stuff that you would think that, like, a typical 20-something-year-old young person would be into. So it created a lot of difficulty for me just even early on, trying to plant my feet into the dating scene and, and find what it is that I'm looking for based off of how I was raised. 